in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. The Lord be with you. Brothers and sisters, welcome again uh, to this uh, morning reflection. Uh, we continue the reading of uh, the book of Genesis. Uh, and today being uh, Wednesday, and uh, 15th uh, February 2023, the first reading is talking about uh, Noah. Noah. Uh, the water has filled the, the earth and uh, Noah has released uh, a dove to go and see how the outside is looking like. Can the world or the earth receive life? The dove went and came back. The dove, we can see, is the symbol of the Spirit of God. When everything is okay, the Spirit of God will work. When the time is okay, the Spirit of God will work. So up to now, in the first reading, the water is still there. God gives time for everything to come into reality, according to His will. And the Gospel, we see this man, the blind, who desired to see and uh, to appreciate uh, the beauty of the world. And he met Jesus Christ, though he was brought by his relative, and begged Jesus to give the person to see again, mm, to see again. And uh, Jesus did something uh, uh, unusual. He spied on the soil and take uh, maram and apply on the eyes of this man, reminding uh, to the person that uh, our life comes from God. This just to know where we come from, our origin, who we are, and what we should value, what we should seek, and how to live in the humility before God. Brothers and sisters, God is capable to restore and restablish you. He's capable to raise you up. He's capable to recreate you, if only you know how to come to Him and let His Spirit to work in you as the same. In the, in, the, in the first reading, the dove of God have gone out from the, that bark, but he came back because the time was not yet. And in the gospel, we see God, Jesus, giving back eyes to appreciate the beauty of the world. It is only God who does marvelous for us. But also, we need to draw ourselves near to him and let him be God in our life. Have a blessed and wonderful day in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen.